Now we are discussing about health services. In that today we are discussing about genomics. Genomics is the study of whole genomes of organisms and incorporates elements from genetics. Genomics uses a combination of of recombinant 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 DNA DNA sequencing methods and bioinformatics to sequence, assemble, and analyze the structure and function of genomes. What is the study of genomics? Genomics is the study of, of all of a person's genes, including interactions of those genes with each other and with the pers person's environment. Next point is what is an example of genomics? Genomics includes the specific, the scientific study of complex diseases such as heart disease, asthma, diabetes, and cancer because these diseases are typically caused more by a combination of genetic and environmental factors than by individual genes. Next point is what is genomics and its types? Types of genomics. Structural genomics aims to determine the, the structure of every protein encoded by the genome. Functional genomics aims to collect and use data from sequencing for describing gene and protein functions. Comparative genomics aims to compare genomic uh, features between uh, different uh, species. And next point is what is genomics healthcare? Genomics uh, medicine is a study for uh, study of our genes and their interaction with our health. Genomics investigates how a person's biological information can be used to improve their clinical care and health outcomes. Example through effective diagnosis and personalized treatment. And next point is how does genomics work? Genomics is the study of whole genomes of organisms and incorporates elements from genetics. Genomic, genomics uses a combination of recombinant, recombinant DNA, DNA sequencing methods and bioinformatics to sequence, assemble and analyze the structure and function of genomics, genomes. And the next point is how is genomics used in medicine? Simply put, the objective of genomic medicine is to determine the genetic basis of those differences in respect to, to in response to environmental agents, including uh, medications, and differences that may uh, predi predispose to the development of common and potentially personally devastating and socially and uh, societally, societally expensive disorders. Next point is, uh, can two people have the same DNA? Human DNA is 99.9% .9 identical from person to person, although 0.1% difference doesn't sound like a lot. It actually represents millions of different locations within the genome where variation can occur, equating a breathtakingly large number of potentially unique DNA sequences. <coughs> And next point is how do you study genomics? Genomics is a relatively now new and ever expanding field dedicated to the study of uh, defining genomes in this more specific way. The direct analysis of the genome of an organism or the genomes of a group of organisms is now possible through advances in the efficiency of DNA sequencing and large scale genetic uh, screening. What is uh, genomic data analysis? The genomics data analysis access series is an advanced series that will enable to stud students, enable students to analyze and interpret data generated by modern genomics technology using open source software, including R and bio and bioconductor. You will acquire skills to analyze and interpret genomic data. Next point is what are genomic tools? Genomics use recombinant DNA technology to analyze the structure and function of the complete set of DNA 
within an organism, most laboratories will use some kind of genomic tool in their research, clinical or forensic applications. The start of most assays require clean, good quality DNA complete template. And next point is what is literary genomics? Genomics is a interdisciplinary field of biology focusing on the structure, function, evaluation, mapping and editing of genomes. genomes. A genome is an organism complete set of DNA include all of its genes. What are the benefits of next point is what are the benefits of genomics? One of the most exciting benefits of genomics and precision medicine is the promise of therapies that are tailored to meet each patient side specific needs. Providers can access an individual genetic code and better determine what sort of treatment is right for him or her leading to better outcomes and lower costs. Next point is why is genomics important in nursing? The use of genetic and genomic information is increasingly important in providing effective health care. Genetics focuses on the individual genes in the genome, generally addressing those conditions resulting from single gene errors, conditions nurses encounter rather infrequently. Next point is what are genomic services? With uh, facilities in Europe, the United States and Asia, Eurofins Genomics is an uh, internationally leading provider of DNA sequencing services, genotyping services, DNA synthesis, synthesis products and bioinformatics services for pharma, diagnostics, food, agriculture and biotechnological and research markets. And next point is what are uh, genomic features? Genomic features refer to defined segments of a genome which offer, which often code for patients and RNAs. Common feature types include gene series. <coughs> next point is uh, what is human genome analysis? The human genome project with an international scientific research project with the goal of uh, determining the base pairs that make up uh, the human DNA and for identifying and mapping all of the genes of the human genome from both a physical and a functional stand standpoint. And next point is what is interesting about DNA? 99.9% .9 of the DNA in all humans is identical. It is a teeny difference that allow, allows us to the individuals, apparently DNA has a half-life of 521 years. In simple terms, this means that the oldest organism that could be cloned could not be more than 2 million years old. This is the information regarding genomics. Wishing you all the best.